What is the meaning of the verb kick back, to? When you kick back money or kick back money to business people or government officials. You illegally and secretly give them a percentage of the money. That they spend with your company as a reward for giving you the business. She offered to kick back 10% if I'd switch to her company. What is the meaning of the verb run around? When you run around a place, you run to various parts of it. The children were running around the museum, and the guard told them to stop. What is the meaning of the verb set up informal? When you commit a crime but make it appear that another. Innocent person is guilty of the crime, you set the innocent person up. Joe robbed the bank and tried to set me up by leaving some of the stolen money in my apartment and then telling the police about it. The detective didn't believe me when I told him I was set up. What is the meaning of the verb fix up, with? When you fix people up with something. You arrange for them to have or to use something that they need or want. We told the hotel desk clerk that we wanted their best room, and she fixed us up with the honeymoon suite. What is the meaning of the verb blow away?
when the wind moves something away from where it was, it blows it away. Don't leave the newspaper outside. The wind will blow it away. The picnic wasn't much fun. It was really windy. And everything kept blowing away. What is the meaning of the verb go out, with? When two people with a romantic interest in each other go out. They go together to a place of entertainment in order to have fun and spend time together. Sally and Jim went out for three years before they got married. What is the meaning of the verb tear off? When you use force to remove a piece of something that is flexible paper. Cloth and so on you tear it off. Alex always tears the tags off his shirt collars. What is the meaning of the verb come on? When a television or radio program comes on, it begins. The late movie comes on at 1 o'clock a. M. What is the meaning of the verb line up? When people or things form a row, they line up. When you arrange people or things so that they form a row, you line them up. People lined up to buy Super Bowl tickets.
Timmy is lining his toy cars up. What is the meaning of the verb work up? When you gradually develop the energy, confidence, courage, and so on. To do something difficult or something you do not want to do, you work up the energy, confidence, courage, and so on. When you gradually develop a feeling, you work up the feeling. If I work up some energy, I'll wash the car. What is the meaning of the verb carry out, of? When you carry something out of a place, you hold it in your hands and take it from that place. It took four guys to carry the pool table out. What is the meaning of the verb run up, to? When you run toward people, you run up or run up to them. After the explosion, a man covered with blood ran up to me and asked for help. What is the meaning of the verb come back? When a fashion or fad comes back, it becomes popular again. Many skirts are coming back this year. What is the meaning of the verb try out? When you try people out, you give them a chance to show that they can perform. A job well before hiring them or before giving them more difficult work to do.
I told the supervisor that if she tried me out, she'd see that I could do the job. What is the meaning of the verb turn on? When you turn on an electrical or mechanical device. You change the controls to make it start producing or doing something. Turn off is the opposite of turn on. Switch on is the same as turn on. Can you turn the light on please? It's dark in here. What is the meaning of the verb sign out? When you sign something out, such as a book or something valuable or important. You write your name on a list to show that you have borrowed the item and are responsible for returning it. The professor signed the book out of the rare book room. What is the meaning of the verb stand for? When abbreviations, acronyms, or symbols represent longer words or groups of words, they stand for them. SCUBA stands for Self-Contained Underwater Breathing Apparatus. What is the meaning of the verb open up? When you open something up, you reveal what is inside so that people can see it. Sophia opened the box up and looked inside. What is the meaning of the verb start up? When you start up a new business or company.
you take the steps necessary to begin a new business or company. Jane borrowed the money she needed to start up her business from her uncle. What is the meaning of the verb grow out of? When people become too mature for a toy, for an interest. Or for a form of behavior, they have grown out of it. Judy had a big crush on a rock star when she was in high school, but after a while she grew out of it. What is the meaning of the verb straighten out? When you straighten out people who are acting foolishly. You do or say something that causes them to act more responsibly. When you straighten out people who are confused, you help them to understand. I told my son that if he gets in trouble one more time, I'm going to send him to military school. That really straightened him out. What is the meaning of the verb put on? When you attach or affix something to another thing, you put it on. The Wilsons put a new roof on their house last year. What is the meaning of the verb turn on, to, informal? When you turn people on to something. You tell them about something you think they will like or something that will help them. Maria turned me on to a great Colombian restaurant.
What is the meaning of the verb look up to? When you look up to people, you admire and respect them. I've always looked up to my father because of his honesty and concern for others. What is the meaning of the verb go off? When an electrical device or system goes off, it stops operating. Come on is the opposite of go off. The electricity went off at 8.30 last night. What is the meaning of the verb pay back, for? When you pay people back or pay people back for something bad they have done to you. You do something bad to them. I'll pay that guy back for the terrible things he's done to me if it takes the rest of my life. What is the meaning of the verb make of? What you make of something is your understanding or opinion of it. So what did you make of the Prime Minister's speech? What is the meaning of the verb fool around? When you waste time playing or doing silly or unimportant things, you fool around. Goof around is the same as fool around. My son is lazy. He spends his time fooling around instead of looking for a job. My boss said, I'm not paying you to fool around get to work.
What is the meaning of the verb stick up? When you push something inside a container or space that is long and narrow, you stick it up. We had to take Susie to the emergency room after she stuck a paper clip up her nose. What is the meaning of the verb straighten out? When something is bent, crooked, or curved and you make it straight, you straighten it out. My elbow is so swollen that I can't straighten my arm out. What is the meaning of the verb go by? When people go by a place or thing, they pass near that place or thing. When a thing goes by or goes by you, it passes near you. I went by Jim's house to see if his car was in the driveway. What is the meaning of the verb stick up? When you push something inside a container or space that is long and narrow, you stick it up. Mark stuck his hand up the chimney to try to find the hidden key. What is the meaning of the verb come out, of? When things or people go through an experience or treatment. The condition they are left in by that experience or treatment or the result of that experience or treatment is how they come out. It was a tough game, but our team came out on top. What is the meaning of the verb bring up, to?
when people bring something from a higher level or position or from south to north to where you are. They bring it up or bring it up to where you are. The rescue workers brought morphine up to the injured mountain climber. What is the meaning of the verb sneak inland to? When you enter a place without anyone seeing or hearing you, you sneak in or sneak into the place. When I was a kid I used to sneak into the movie theater through the emergency exit. What is the meaning of the verb see about? When you are upset about a change or a new policy. And you want to say that you will take some action or talk to someone in authority to prevent or reverse the change or new policy. You say I'll see about that or we'll see about that. Those crooks in City Hall want to double my real estate taxes. What is the meaning of the verb go back on? When you make a promise, but you do not do what you promised to do, you go back on your promise. I promised to take my son to a baseball game, and I'm not going back on my word. What is the meaning of the verb turn off? When you turn off an electrical or mechanical device. You change the controls to stop it from producing or doing something. Turn on is the opposite of turn off. Switch off and shut off are similar to turn off.
When I'm driving and have to wait for a long freight train to pass, I always turn my car off. What is the meaning of the verb stand around? When you stand around, you stand in a place wasting time and not doing anything useful. I have all this work to do, and you guys just stand around watching me. The manager told them to stop standing around and get to work. What is the meaning of the verb show up? When you appear somewhere, you show up. Turn up is similar to show up. Over a hundred people showed up for the news conference. What is the meaning of the verb con out of informal? When you con people out of something, you persuade them to give it to you by fooling or deceiving them. Marvin conned them out of their life savings. What is the meaning of the verb go back, to? When a condition, problem, practice, or custom goes back to a certain time, it began at that time. His drug problem goes back to his college years. What is the meaning of the verb make out, to? When you write the necessary information on the front of a check, you make the check out. When you write the name of a person, company, or other organization on the check.
you make the check out to that person, company, or organization. There must be a mistake, this check is made out to my brother, not to me. What is the meaning of the verb get inland to? When you get in or get into a place, you arrive. When the vehicle you are in gets in or gets into a place, it arrives. Come in is similar to get in. I'm exhausted. I got in really late last night. What is the meaning of the verb stick up? When you put something, such as a picture, sign. Or notice, in a place where people can see it, you stick it up. I'm going to stick these no smoking signs up all over the school. What is the meaning of the verb put on? When you place something on or apply something to another surface, you put it on. Jerry put too much fertilizer on his lawn, and now he has to cut it twice a week. What is the meaning of the verb wear out? When something wears you out, it makes you very tired. Shoveling snow for three hours would wear anyone out. What is the meaning of the verb go ahead, with? When you take an action you have already considered doing, you go ahead with the action.
After she learned about Jim's drug problem, Raquel went ahead with the marriage anyway. What is the meaning of the verb sell out, of, often passive? When a store sells out of something or is sold out of something, it sells all of it. The toy store sold out of anti-gravity boots in two days. What is the meaning of the verb cut back, on? When you cut back or cut back on something that you consume, you use it less. When you cut back or cut back on something that you do, you do it less. Cut down is similar to cut back. You're getting a little overweight, maybe you should cut back on sweets. What is the meaning of the verb come over, to? When people move from one side of a place to the other. Where you are, they come over or come over to where you are. Come over here and say that again. What is the meaning of the verb back down? When one side in a disagreement stops making threats and lets the other have what it wants or do what it wants. The side that stops making threats backs down. The dictator didn't back down after the United Nations Security Council voted in favor of sending in troops. What is the meaning of the verb get out, of? When you get something out or get something out of a container or place, 
you remove it. The videotape is jammed, I can't get it out of the VCR. What is the meaning of the verb carry on? When you carry something on an airplane, you keep it with you in the passenger. Compartment instead of giving it to an airline agent to put in the baggage compartment. You should carry your laptop computer on. You don't want to take any chances. What is the meaning of the verb take off in? Takeoff is when an airplane leaves the ground and flies up into the air. The takeoff was delayed because of the snow. What is the meaning of the verb step on? When you step on something, you place your foot on it. If the carpenter steps on a nail, she'll have to go to the hospital for a tetanus shot. What is the meaning of the verb hit on informal? When you hit on a person of the opposite sex. You approach and aggressively try to interest that person in you romantically or sexually. Let's go somewhere else Mark keeps hitting on me, and I'm tired of it. What is the meaning of the verb keep on? When you keep people on at their place of employment, you continue to employ them.
Everyone on the hotel staff was fired after the hotel went out of business. Except for two guys who were kept on to clean and paint the building. What is the meaning of the verb zip up? When you zip up a coat or other item of clothing, you close it with a zipper. I can't zip my dress up. Can you? What is the meaning of the verb go away, to? When you leave your home and live temporarily at another place, such as a school, you go away to that place. Jane didn't go away to school, she went to a school near her home. What is the meaning of the verb pay back, for? When you pay people back or pay people back for something bad they have done to you. You do something bad to them. Jake shot Hank to pay him back for turning him into the police. What is the meaning of the verb go through with? When you do something that you have decided to do even though it may be. Dangerous or unpleasant or others may object, you go through with it. Despite his family's opposition. Eric went through with his decision to quit his job and start his own business. What is the meaning of the verb call up? When you call people up, 
you call them on the telephone. I'm called up by charities asking for money. What is the meaning of the verb cut off? When you create a physical or psychological barrier between yourself and other people. You cut yourself off from them. When you are separated from other people because of a barrier or a great distance. You are cut off from them. After Dan joined a cult, he completely cut himself off from his family and friends. A flash flood cut us off from the rest of the expedition. What is the meaning of the verb have on? When you have an electrical device on, you are using it. Last summer was so cool that we had the air conditioner on only two or three times. What is the meaning of the verb go beyond? When people or things are better or worse. Or do something in a better or worse way than is normal or expected, they go beyond what is normal or expected. Did you say Jackson's new book is good? I think it goes beyond good it's fantastic. Sam's wife discovered that he wasn't just friends with his secretary. Their relationship went way beyond friendship. What is the meaning of the verb breakthrough?
when you use force to go through a wall or other barrier, you break through it. The thieves broke through the wall of the jewelry store. What is the meaning of the verb check in? When you give your luggage to an airline agent so that it will be carried in. The baggage compartment rather than the passenger compartment, you check it in. That bag is too big for carry-on you'll have to check it in. What is the meaning of the verb breakdown? When an arrangement, agreement, negotiation, plan, or marriage breaks down. One or more persons involved is not cooperating or participating because of a disagreement or problem. The peace negotiations broke down because neither side was willing to compromise. What is the meaning of the verb break down? When something decomposes or reduces to its smallest parts or is reduced by someone to its smallest parts, it breaks down. After the poison breaks down, it's quite harmless. What is the meaning of the verb go down, to? When something goes down in a certain way, people react to or perceive it in this way. The judge's decision went down well with the prosecutor. What is the meaning of the verb keep up, with?
when you can understand and respond to a situation that is changing. You are able to keep up with the situation. Jane always has some new idea. I can't keep up with her. What is the meaning of the verb turn out usually followed by to be plus an adjective? An infinitive verb plus a noun, or a complete sentence. When things or people turn out to be a certain way, it is discovered or considered that they are that way. When things or people turn out to be something, it is discovered or considered that they are that thing. When you say that it turns out, that, or turned out, that, and then make a statement of fact. You mean that this information, which is contrary to what you believed or expected, was discovered to be true? I thought Sam bought a Mercedes-Benz, but it turned out that he bought a BMW. What is the meaning of the verb look up? When you locate and visit people you have not seen for a long time, you look them up. I was in Dallas on business, and I looked up Dan Jones, my old college roommate. What is the meaning of the verb blow up? When something blows up or when someone blows something up. It becomes much larger because air or something else is being forced into it. Hank blew up a beach ball and threw it in the pool.
What is the meaning of the verb? Get out of. If an activity gives you pleasure, satisfaction, or some other benefit. You get pleasure, satisfaction, or some other benefit out of it. I sat through that boring class for three months and didn't learn a thing. I didn't get anything out of it. What is the meaning of the verb throw up? When something causes small particles of dirt, dust, or a liquid to rise into the air, it throws them up. Don't stand too close to the fire, it's throwing up sparks. What is the meaning of the verb shut up, about, informal? When people stop talking, they shut up or shut up about something they are talking about. When you are angry and want people to stop talking, you tell them to shut up. I said I was sorry about crashing your car. Now will you please shut up about it? What is the meaning of the verb go out, of? When people or things leave a place, room, or house that you are in, they go out or go out of it. Come in is the opposite of go out. Nancy was so sick that she didn't go out of the house for a week. What is the meaning of the verb point to?
when you indicate people or things with your hand or a finger, you point to them. When an arrow or a sign indicates something, it points to it. The waitress couldn't hear me, so I pointed to my empty glass and she understood. The prosecutor asked, can you point to the man you saw carrying the gun? What is the meaning of the verb go around? When people or things follow an indirect or curved path in order to avoid an obstacle or to change direction. They go around or go around the obstacle. Heather went around the curve too fast, and she ended up in the ditch. What is the meaning of the verb run out, of? When people or things run out or run out of a place, room, building, and so on, they leave it very quickly. Run inland to is the opposite of run out. When I opened the door, the dog ran out of the house. What is the meaning of the verb wash up? When you wash up, you wash your hands thoroughly. The surgeon washed up before the operation. What is the meaning of the verb go in for? When you go in for a certain activity, you like it and do it regularly. Brian really goes in for any kind of outdoor activity.
What is the meaning of the verb knock off? When you knock something off, you either accidentally or deliberately use. Force to make it fall from a place above the ground to the ground below. Susie knocked a glass off the table and broke it. What is the meaning of the verb rule out? When you rule out people or things, you eliminate them from a list. When you rule out doing something, you decide that it is something you will not do because you do not want to, because it is impossible, and so on. With all these medical bills to pay, maybe we should consider ruling out buying a new car. What is the meaning of the verb stand for? When you will not stand for something that you think is illegal. Improper, or unjust, you will not tolerate it or allow it to happen. I told my son I wouldn't stand for that kind of language in this house. What is the meaning of the verb take out? When you take people out slash you go with them to do something enjoyable dinner in a restaurant. A movie, and so on and pay for it yourself. Jim took his girlfriend out last Friday. What is the meaning of the verb fall behind, in? When you do not make the regular payments you are required to make.
you fall behind or fall behind in your payments. When I lost my job, I fell behind in my mortgage payments. What is the meaning of the verb screw up informal? When people make a mistake that causes a problem for you, they screw you up. You really screwed me up when you lost my car keys. What is the meaning of the verb stick to? When you stick to a certain belief, claim, policy, habit, plan. type of work, and so on, you continue as before, without change. Stick with is similar to stick to. Jake claimed he was innocent of Hank's murder. He stuck to his alibi that he had been at the racetrack when the murder occurred. What is the meaning of the verb come on informal? When you think that people have done or said something improper or unreasonable, you say come on. Tom didn't study for one minute, and you're telling me he got 100 on the test? Oh, come on. What is the meaning of the verb get on, with? When you continue doing something, you get on, get on with what you were doing, or get on with it? I didn't say you could stop. Get on with your work.
What is the meaning of the verb goof around informal? When you waste time playing or doing silly or unimportant things, you goof around. Fool around is the same as goof around. My brother drives his teachers crazy. He constantly goofs around and creates problems. What is the meaning of the verb cheat on? When you cheat on your sexual partner, you have sex or a romantic relationship with another person. Sarah filed for divorce after she caught George cheating on her. Can you believe it? What is the meaning of the verb let off? When you fire a gun or explode bombs or fireworks, you let them off. Regional, when you let off steam. You express angry feelings or frustration or do something to relieve those feelings. When I was a kid I used to love letting off firecrackers on the 4th of July. What is the meaning of the verb back up? When you are explaining something, and you repeat something that you already said, you back up. You're going too fast. Can you back up a little and explain your plan again? What is the meaning of the verb fill up? When a room or other area fills up, people enter it until it is full.
The hotels in Rio de Janeiro always fill up at carnival time. What is the meaning of the verb dry up? When something dries up or something dries it up, all the water or other liquid in it goes away. The sun came out and dried up all the rain. The Great Salt Lake is slowly drying up. What is the meaning of the verb break down? When you reduce a process, situation, problem, plan. Or idea to its basic parts to make it easier to understand, you break it down. If you break the manufacturing process down into steps, it's easier to train new workers. What is the meaning of the verb cover up? When you cover up a crime, you do something to try to prevent other people from learning of it. The mayor was accused of covering up his ties to organized crime. What is the meaning of the verb put back? When you put something back, you return it to where it was before. After you finish listening to my CDs, please put them back. What is the meaning of the verb come in? When a thing or skill comes in handy. It is something useful that you like to have available when you need it.
I don't know how to speak Japanese, but knowing how to say the numbers. And please and thank you when I was in Japan sure came in handy. What is the meaning of the verb break up? When you break up a fight, you stop the fight. There was no way I could break up the fight between the two dogs. What is the meaning of the verb pick up? Habit, you acquire the habit. I picked up a few stock tips from a guy I met on the plane. What is the meaning of the verb fall apart? When the parts of something become completely separated. Because it is old or in bad condition, it falls apart. These old shoes are starting to fall apart. What is the meaning of the verb make up the noun and adjectives? Derived from this verb are much more commonly used than the verb itself. When you make yourself up, you put lipstick, eyeshadow, and so on, on your face. She made herself up and went to the party. What is the meaning of the verb give back, to? When you return something to someone, you give it back. Can I use your pen? I'll give it back after the test.
What is the meaning of the verb get around to? When you do something after waiting for some time because you are lazy. Inefficient, or do not want to do it, you get around to it. Don't worry about the broken window. I'll get around to it one of these days. What is the meaning of the verb lighten up, on, informal? When you lighten up or lighten up on people, you become less harsh or less strict in your treatment of them. You're awfully hard on your daughter. Maybe you ought to lighten up on her. What is the meaning of the verb wipe up? When you completely remove a liquid from a surface by moving a towel. Or sponge across it with a sweeping motion, you wipe the liquid up. Wipe up is similar to wipe off. However, you wipe up a liquid. But you wipe off the surface the liquid is on. You'd better wipe up the water on the bathroom floor before someone falls. <laughs>